Yeah, so when I got the error message, I was just surfing like Facebook, Instagram, different things like that. Can you click somewhere before getting the warning message? Um, so I was trying to get some stuff from my wife for Christmas, and there were some ads that popped up that said stuff that we might like, and I was just trying to find the stuff that she liked. Um, so what, what is your, what is the number you're calling from? Can you confirm me the number? The number I'm calling from or the number I called? The number you're calling from. Yeah, it's 919-865-1996. All right, thank you. So, sir, right now, I will give you a few couple of instructions which you need to follow so that we can diagnose the computer and we will check what's the problem and what we need to fix it, okay? No problem. I'm really good at following instruction. And I would like to tell you, sir, that there will be there may might be charges to fix the computer if we found the problem and if the warranty of the computer is expired. No, no problem. I just I gotta get this fixed uh, before uh, Jennifer gets down, or she'll be very mad at me. All right. So what you need to do is you need to hold down the Windows key and press R like Romeo. Is that the flag key? The Windows key on the keyboard. Okay, and then R for robot? Yeah, R for Romeo. Okay, a little box popped up that says type the name of any program, folder, document, or internet resource and Windows will open it for you. Right, so in the box in lowercase you need to type I explore. Okay, I explore. Space www dot www dot any desk dot com any desk dot com okay now click OK and tell me what do you see um it's a website and there's a big green box to it says free download or one that it says uh, business download. I'm sorry to repeat that. There's, it's the anydesk.com website that I'm on, and it's S, there's a spot to download for free with green for personal use, and then there's a white box for buy it for business. Okay, click on free download. Okay, it started a little exe file downloading in the corner. Which corner? The left corner it says any desk exe. Okay, you know what? Sir? Do not call us back, okay? Why? You do not call us back. Well, are you gonna fix my computer or not? No, take it to the local store. We don't. We don't have a local store. Not to mention the local store is not the number that's on my computer right now. So why aren't you? Uh, fix my, why aren't you? Why aren't you gonna fix my computer? So you can, no, uh, you can take fucking, your computer. Answer my fucking question, boy. Why aren't you gonna fix my computer? Your fucking number came up. I downloaded the any desk that you want. I have it installed and I'm ready to go. Fix my computer. Okay, then 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 install install the anydesk.com. Okay, I'm installing it right now. It's running. Alright, it popped open. Once it is. And it says, remote desktop, please enter the address of the remote desk you would like to access. Right, so you will see under this, under this desk, it gives you a number. Oh yeah, 518-492-168. Repeat that. 518-492-168. One six eight. Why were you One, so hostile eight, with eight. me a minute ago? I don't understand. I'm sorry. You you were getting very hostile with me. I'm just trying to get my computer fixed, like the pop up told me to do. I called you guys. Mm -hmm. I mean, as soon as I got it, I called. I mean, what else am I supposed to do? Are you still there? Yeah, I mean. Okay, do you know how long it's going to take for you to fix my computer? You will you will get an accept option soon sometime. Okay, yeah I see that. Mm -hmm. 
Then got a countdown. Yeah, right? except. I got a wait yeah, except. Two seconds. Okay, I accepted it. Okay, just wait. Okay. Hello? Um, yeah. Yeah. Don't call us back. You are an asshole. Why, why am I an asshole? Call's over! Oh, I'm definitely calling that fucker back. He got mad because I connect, or tried to connect to his computer from my main computer. But we're, we're, we're definitely calling that fucker back. I don't remember what his name is, though. Yeah. Looks like he disconnected. Thanks for calling the code. You're speaking to Dennis. How can I help you? Um, yeah, hi Dennis. Um, I was talking to one of your customer relations people, and I was getting ready to give him my any desk ID, and we got disconnected. Okay. So, I can see, yeah, you, you know what? You are an asshole. Why am I right. an asshole, sir? Explain to me why I'm an asshole, please. Call's over! <laughs> I guess that was the same guy. Alright, hold on. And then if she doesn't pick up Jennifer, I'll call him back. Hello? Alright, we'll call you right back. Call's over! I'm gonna switch to Jennifer. Call him back. They may not pick up, it may be the same caller ID, I'm not sure, we'll have to see. It was 9 something, so now it's 503 instead. Thank you for calling. Please leave a message and your call will be returned as soon as possible. Um, yeah, hi. My name's Jennifer, and I got this pop-up on my screen, and it said for me to call you guys right away, but nobody's picking up. So, uh, could you give me a call back on my cell phone? It looks pretty urgent, so if you could give me a call back, like, right away, that would be appreciated. Thanks. Call's over! <laughs>